Hi, welcome to the Magic of Math, where we master math one video at a time. Today, we're going to learn about the proof for the Pythagorean Theorem. So, a Pythagorean Theorem states that a squared plus b squared equals c squared for a right triangle. And we know that the legs are a and b, and they form the right angle of the triangle and our hypotenuse, or our side that is across from our 90 degree angle, is labeled C, our hypotenuse, reminding you that the Pythagorean theorem only holds true for right triangles. So it says that we're going to square this side. So that means when we know the numerical value for A, we do A times A, or A squared. Same thing with B squared. And when we find A squared, we add it to B squared, and it will equal C squared. So let's replace A with a value 3. So we're going to say that this leg, side A, has a measurement of 3, and that B has a measurement of 4, and C has a measurement of 5. So this is to help us prove the Pythagorean Theorem. So we're going to square 3, which is going to be 3 squared, 4 squared, and 5 squared. Now visualize that. 3 squared is an area of 9, 3 times 3. So these 9 squares represent 3 squared, because 3 squared is 3 times 3, or 9. Now visualize this. We have a 4 by 4 square with an area of 16, which is 4 squared. And on this side, our hypotenuse side, we're going to do a 5 by 5 square, which is 25 squares, or 5 squared. So now let's take this over. That means that our a squared, which is 3 squared, our b squared, which is 4 squared, and our c squared, which is 5 squared, need to be these added together will equal this. So there's a couple of things you could do. We know that we have 9 squares here, and we have 16 squares here. 9 plus 16 is 25, and that's how many squares I have here. The other way we can visualize this is we could take this 16, our yellow, our b squared side, and put it on top of our c squared, or a 5 squared. And then we can piece together, here's 3 of our squares, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then 8, 9. And we can see that our squares from the a and b squared side fit perfectly on top of c squared and equal that. We also can prove it mathematically. 9 plus 16 equals 25, and it checks. And there's the proof of how the Pythagorean Theorem works. Thanks for joining me today and learning all about proving the Pythagorean Theorem. Try it on any right triangle that you know, and it'll work. Thanks for joining me at the Magic of Math, where we continue to master math one video at a time. Have a great day.